probability when we talk about the probability of something happening we are referring to the likelihood or chances of it happening probability we say sometimes we say the probability that it will rain is 20% we say the probability that if two dice are tossed the scores will total to 7 is 1 by 6 probability can be expressed as a fraction a decimal or even a percent how to find probability we can find probability by this rule probability of an event e is equal to favorable number of outcomes divided by total number of outcomes outcomes are the result of an experiment and we also use s the sample space sample space is a set of all possible outcomes so we can say same thing we can mention it like this number of favorable outcomes and e divided by total number of outcome that is n s we'll take an example of a coin here is a coin can you see what is written here half dollar okay so there are two sides of a coin the side which has face is called head this side is head we denote it by h the other side is called tail so we have one head and one tail in a coin what is the sample space of a coin head and tail correct okay. now what is the probability of getting head so we say probability of getting head how many heads are there one out of two so it is 1 by 2 or point 5 what is the probability of getting tail again one tail so 1 out of total events 2 sample space 2 n of s is 2 you can say n of s is 2 so probability of getting tail is also half that is point 5 and next let's try a die you remember this a die has six faces and there are spots on it the spot on one face it is one two spots three spots four spots five and six it's a six faced die so we say this is s What is n of s? Six. Total number six. Now, if we want, what is the probability of getting, say, two? How many twos are there? One. So n of e divided by n of s. One divided by six. Correct. Now, what is the probability of getting an even number? probability of getting even number even number of spots how many even numbers for circle let's circle them how many even numbers 2 is even 4 is even 6 is even so there are three even numbers we say 3 divided by total is 6 3 by 6 we can cancel and say it is half 3 by 6 means half one more okay let's try what is the probability that when you throw a die you get a number less than equal to say 5 so first see how many numbers are less than equal to 5 One, two, three, four, five is also included. It's less than equal. So there are five numbers, and total is six. So probability of getting a number 
less than equal to 5 is 5 by 6. Now come to two dice. When we roll two dice together, so on one die we have numbers 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. On the other die also we have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. When we do throw two die together, we may have 1 and 1. One and one, one and two, you can have one on one die and two on the other, one and three, one and four, one and five, these are the possibilities. Or we can have two on one die and one on other die. We can have two and two, same way. We can have 2, 4, 2, 5, 2, 6. Complete this table. 3, 1, 3, 2, 3, 3, 3, 4, 3, 5, 3, 6. 4, 1, 4, 2, 4, 3, 4, 4. We can have 4, 5, 4, 6. 5, 1, 5, 2, 5, 3, 5, 4, 5, 5, 5, 6. 6, 1, 6, 2, 6, 3, 6, 4, 6, 5, 6, 6. Now, let's count S. S, N of S, sample space. How many possibilities are there? Total number of outcomes. 6 and 6. Total will be 36. Okay, question. What is the probability that the sum of two numbers, the sum of spots on two dice is equal to 5? So, probability of getting sum of spots on two dice. is 5 so for that we have to see how many possibilities are there let's start counting some should be 5 so 1 is we will use some other color to circle it ok 5 the sum is 5 so this is 1 plus 4 5 then 2 plus 3, 5, 3 plus 2, 5, 4 plus 1, 5. So, how many are there? 1, 2, 3, 4. Correct? So, we will say total possible outcomes are 4 and total outcomes are 36. Answer is 1 by 9. What is the possibility? What is the probability? of getting same next number that the sum of spots on two dice is at least 10 at least 10 what is the meaning of at least 10 at least means minimum should be 10 so more than equal to No, that means 10 is also included. So, we can have the sum 10, 11 and 12. So, we will use other color to circle it. And let's see. We can take the sum 10, 11 and 12. 10, which numbers will give us 10? 6 and 4. 4 and 6. 5 and 5 and 6 and 4 so 3 this then we can also have the sum 11 at least 10 means 10 11 and 12 are included so 5 and 6 6 and 5 we can also have 12 6 and 6 how many are there 1 2 3 4 5 6 so we'll say 
6 by 36 that is 1 by 6. So this way you can do any question whatever they ask. Check the favorable number of outcomes and total number of outcomes. Thank you.